Hi, my name is Russ, and I'm kind of excited to show you this chat GPT tool. Uh, so it's kind of an alternative to uh, to Google. If, say, you wanted to look up the command for uh, you know muting the volume on your Mac, you could you could ask this AI to do that for you. Uh, you go to um, chat.openai.com and log in, um, and then you can ask it questions uh, like, "What's the command to?" mute your volume or you know I'll show you some others in the future and I, I know you can of course you know Google Google the same thing and you know kind of figure it out uh, you know but I like their you know answers or its answers um, and they you know they're surprisingly complete and I mean your mileage varies a bit because you can ask the same question multiple times and it will give you different answers um, but you know they're all, they're generally correct I've had it before where I ask it to write me a script and the script sort of you know takes in theory it could work if I put enough effort into like installing its dependencies but um, you know your mileage may vary like I said but if you just ask it to, to give you the command for something like you know sort of something simple that you want to run via trigger CMD like uh, turn up the volume on your Windows computer it's likely to know that command or um, if you wanted to write you a script to to do something similar it can do that um, so let's see I had one here uh, that I asked it earlier uh, let's see St uh, command to run a Steam game. Yeah. Oh, we gotta wait till that finishes. So I noticed a lot of their examples use uh, NIR command, N I R C M D dot exe. Um, it's a really cool tool that you should download. I even I did a um, if you if you have Windows that is, uh, it does a ton of stuff. You can see that on their on their page, but um, on, if, on the trigger CMD, uh, what's it called? You know, forum. You'll see a bunch of examples uh, using their command. But anyway, I'll move on. Uh, command to run a Steam game. Let's see. It's thinking harder on that one. Come on. You can do it, chat GPT. Yeah, it's really thinking. You know, I might be just busy today. It's Saturday. Come on. All right, to run a Steam game from the command line, you can use the Steam command with the Steam run game game ID URL. Game ID is unique. It's a unique identifier for the game. All right. Uh, and to be honest, I've already done this. Um, and to get the game ID, you can you know look up the the game in the store, and then copy the uh, the URL, and just take the ID out of the URL. Like my, my game that I play is Rocket League. Um, so you can then take that ID. Oops, I've already done this, so it's here already. Um, but right there. Same. And so now I can say, uh, "Hey Google, turn on Rocket," because that's the name. That's the voice word I used. Okay, turning the rocket on. The rocket. So it's it's launching launching Rocket League, um, in window mode because I didn't want it to take the full screen. Come on, there it is. So you get the idea. Uh, it's called Chat GPT. Uh, it's it's only out since November. Um, I've already found found some pretty cool use cases for it. That's all I got. Thanks for watching.